I have to give you guys a very serious warning before we start this video. This is going to be some of the cringiest things that you've probably seen in a very long time. This is cringe on a whole other level. And of course, of course it is. Like this is what this is what Hollywood celebrities continue to do. They continue to think that they are doing good for society, that they are, well, I don't know, even know if they necessarily believe that or not. I think that they, what they're trying to do is destabilize society. But, you know, they're continuing to uh, virtue signal whenever they get on stage for all these different events and stuff. Stuff. And that's exactly what Ricky Gervais was talking about, what he was calling out during the Golden Globes ceremony uh, a couple of years ago, right? So, but nobody apparently uh, listened at all to what Ricky Gervais had to say during that entire thing, which, by the way, what he said was fantastic. So, what we have here is we have now, we have Nick Offerman and Megan Mullally, who are uh, up here on stage during the Independent Spirit Awards, uh, the Film Independent Spirit Awards for this year. Uh, you know, they're, they're apparently the hosts and all that stuff. And they decide that they're going to do the very, very brave thing. Very brave thing. Something that has never been done before. It is beyond any courage that we have seen from humanity ever in the history of the world. They decide they were going to tell Putin to F off. I'm not kidding you. And of course, they it was met with cheers. And all of the wokesters out there, they're all like, oh, so, so brave so stunning oh my goodness oh <laughs> it's so ridiculous so anyway let's go ahead and get into this and uh oh man like i, I warned you this is gonna be super cringy so nick offerman and mega malali tell putin to f off and go home giving middle finger while hosting award show hollywood actor couple nick offerman and all right so uh so basically, um, basically there isn't any footage out there yet of this, any video footage. So, but there was um, a description of it from Hollywood Reporter with what they said. So after returning from a commercial break, the co-hosts took a moment to show their solidarity with and support of Ukraine, reported the Hollywood Reporter on Sunday. Offerman began by telling the audience that they'd like to send best wishes to those affected by the war in Ukraine and all unjust conflicts around the world. Okay, so far, so far, so good, right? Okay, okay, I, I can get on board with that. And then they said this. This is coming from, uh, this is coming, <laughs> this is coming from, uh, from Megan. I think we speak for everyone here when we say we are hoping for a quick and peaceful resolution. Now, if you just stopped right there, I'd be like, yeah, I can, I can agree with that. Yeah, totally. I am totally on board with that. I am pro-peace, anti-war, all the way totally on board with all of that and then <laughs> oh man and then uh and then uh she said this specifically f off and go home putin and then it just the the room erupted in applause <gasps> oh so brave so brave <laughs> sorry i should not be laughing this is serious it takes a lot of courage to to be up there on stage you know with your uh thousand dollar suit on you know man lots of jewelry all that nice stuff you know coming from your mansion all that good stuff it takes a lot of courage to be up there on stage with your your peers in the crowd all of your 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 woke celebrity friends and to say specifically f off and go home putin <sighs> the courage it's it really is it's it's stunning it really is stunning i i'm speechless i'm beyond words <laughs> oh man offerman then asked the audience to send putin off with a spirit award salute as he and malali both held up their middle fingers to the camera <laughs> oh man this just reminds me of like uh all the hollywood celebrities doing like their black and white um stupid video where they sang oh what song was that uh we're all in this together and stuff and uh you know it's oh my gosh i'm just so t sick and tired of all this type of nonsense i'm so tired of it it's just pandering it's it's ridiculous we're not all in this together i'm sorry and saying this you're not you're just virtue signaling you're just trying to you know find attention that's all you're doing and uh, uh thankfully there's a lot of us that can see right through that and see that and are like yeah 
yeah we we see and this this whole thing was was just terrible by the way Th there isn't a video clip out there right now of them actually doing the flipping off thing but they were trying to tell these jokes during the ceremony and they were just terrible turning to the cinema movies are back wait no 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 don't don't applaud they're they're not going to see your movies okay no. They're going to see the eighth Spider-Man for the sixth time. I saw Red Rocket six times. Six times? You watched it three more times without me? Maybe. Uh, it's so cringe. It's so bad. It's so bad. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe for new. I'd appreciate that a lot. Like, all that good stuff. Leave a comment, and I'll talk to you in another video very soon. Bye.